Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video I will be installing and running Elasticsearch in Kibana. The first step is to go to Elasticsearch official website to download sections to Elasticsearch and download appropriate zip files for your machine. I'm on Mac so um, you'll be downloaded this and pay attention for which version you install in, that for you will install the same version for Kibana. So I'm downloaded this while this is in process. I'm going to the same download section on Elasticsearch but Kibana. If you want to see your URL for that and making sure it's the same version as for Elasticsearch, the same type of download for your appropriate machine, Mac, download this. And then once it's finished, you will need to unzip them. So Elasticsearch finished. I'm extracting this, go to Kibana, do the same, extracting this. Once it's unzipped, you can, in your console, navigate to location. My goes to downloads. So we have here Elasticsearch, have here Kibana. So we'll start with Elasticsearch. And just copy this location. And go to this location. Let's see what we have there. Okay, we need to go to B. So we have here all plugins installed in Elasticsearch search itself. So and just to run it by default, it will be running on localhost port 9200. run this and then we can go to browser localhost port 9200 and we have our elastic search serial cluster name name cluster name whatever default was see version 662 now we'll open another terminal window and let's make it bigger that you can see so let's check where we are we go to downloads again so now we go to Kibana so bin so we have Kibana installed, so just run Kibana. So Kibana will be running on port 5601. For all settings, you can go enter config files, I believe, open config file and this is basically where you will change configurations for your Kibana and the same for Elasticsearch or the same YAML file so once we started Kibana and now we can go to localhost on port Five six zero one. Don't need the date right now. And there you go. Kibana installed with Elasticsearch. And that basically how easy and simple it is. And that's it for my videos. 
thanks for watching and see you in my next one bye